Sydney, you can go ahead and start filming. 15 milliliters of water to my empty can. All right, so I've added, I've already done that. 15 milliliters of water to the empty can. So now I'm gonna put the can on the tripod stand. All right, and I'm going to put my safety glasses on because I'm gonna be lighting a match and lighting the alcohol burner. Go ahead and do that. Remember, I typically want to hold my hand lower. Oh, what the hell? Weird. Smoke blew into my face and like I was like breathing smoke. That was crazy. That was cool. I don't know. It's going to light. It's going to light. There we go. Okay. So now, I have my flame lit. I'm going to slide the block under. I'm not going to pick the tripod stand up. I'm going to slide the block under the can. Okay? Do you have a good view? Mm hmm Okay. So, what I want to do now is I'm just kind of going to watch the can. Uh, eventually, you probably know what's gonna, what I'm going to see here in a few moments. What do you think that will be? What's going to what's gonna start to escape the can? Andrew? Steam. Steam. Okay. Once I start to see a little steam start rising out the top, there's also something else in this empty can. So I got you. So I poured a little bit of water in. So I told you that's in there. What else is in this empty can? There's one other substance in this can. Cameron? Is it um, liquid? We poured the water in, but there's something else in this empty can. Oh, Sierra. Air. Air. Okay. So as I'm adding energy by heating it. Uh, what's going to happen to the water molecules that are in there? And I haven't seen them yet, but I'll just see them here in a moment. So I'm going to go ahead and start my timer. All right. So when I start to see steam, I'm going to start my timer. So what is happening to those molecules, whether they're water or air molecules, in the can while I'm heating it? What are they? They're gaining something. What do you think they're gaining, Pat? Pass it along. Bryson? Pressure. Well, they can get out, so they are gaining a little bit of pressure, but they can escape pretty easily. So they're not really gaining pressure because they're not trapped. All right? If they were trapped, they'd be gaining pressure. They're gaining energy. All right? We're adding energy because we're heating it. All right? So we're adding energy, and it, my, my can is, has been steaming a little bit. All right? I'm gonna let my timer go for about a minute 15 to a minute 30 after I first start to see steam, okay? What's that doing to the air and the water that's trapped and it's inside the can? What's that doing to the air and water inside the can? What do you think, Jackie? If you see the steam rising out of the top, what does that tell you about the water? It's getting hot and it's doing what else? Bryson? Boiling. Boiling? And the water molecules that were in the can that were measured out in the graduated cylinder are doing what, Leah? Bubbling. Bubbling and they're also, Andrew? Evaporating. Evaporating. They're leaving the can. Okay. So I'm right at about a minute 30 <laughs> since I started seeing steam. This is the important part. There are a lot of classes, or a lot of groups seem to struggle a little bit with this. I'm going to put my goggles back on. All right. You want to make sure that you do these steps right. So you're going to grab your tongs. Okay palm up, all right? Because part of what we're, I have to do is flip this can over quickly into the container of water. Mine's clear so that you can see how, how far it goes in. You want your palm up because otherwise if I have my palm down, then I have to go like this and it's awkward, okay? It's much easier to go this way. You have to do this quickly, okay? We don't want air to get into or out of the can as we're transferring it. You also need to make sure that the opening when I pick this one up and turn it upside down, the opening goes straight into the water, okay? You don't want it like this because that will allow air to either get into or out of the can, okay? So you need to go straight into the water. If you do this right, you should see a pretty cool reaction. Here we go. Yo! All right? Okay, so you stop filming.